Hey, what's going on, card collectors? This is uh, Sox fan Timmy F. And uh, it is Thursday night. It was a very extremely busy day for myself. Um, went holiday shopping and work and my daughter's pageant, Christmas pageant tonight. I came home, got to see the bears whoop it on with the cowboys. That was pretty sweet. And now lastly here, um, I'm keeping my voice down a little bit because everyone's sleeping in the house, but we've got a, a box I'm going to open up here. It's 2019 Topps Heritage Minor League. I don't expect much from this box. I'm looking for a couple of guys that did really well um, or made an impact uh, in the pros this year. A lot of guys that showed up in Update. I'm pretty sure they're going to be in here. Um, as far as autographs or memorabilia, you know, I really don't care about that. Uh, it would be nice, but it's not like I won't be upset if I don't get a Wander Franco uh, autograph or one of the other big names. But it's just something fun to do. So I got this box on uh, Black Friday, rbicrew.com. I will put their uh, link in the description. Uh, their Instagram account is one of the best. So they're located in, I don't want to say southern Missouri, but they're located in Missouri, which is pretty south of me in Illinois. I think it's, I looked it up on Google Maps. I think it's like maybe a four and a half hour drive or whatever it is. But man, if you want to look at a blueprint of how you should run a card shop, and how you should get your social media involved, those guys are on point. So kudos to uh, the crew at um, rbicrew.com. All right, let's get into this rip. Um, some of the players we are going to be looking for, uh, I got the Fall League roster here, so I'm going to put it up. You guys can uh, take a snapshot if you want it. So These are going to be some of the future players that you're going to be looking for from uh, the Fall League, which isn't always the best one, but I also have a link I'll put in the description of um, 2019's Future Star game that happened the day before the MLB All-Star game. They had a lot of studs in it. So you, uh, if you're a prospector looking like me, you know, looking for, um, uh, you know, future stars um, that you can invest in cheaply and hopefully flip them in the future or hang on to them, whatever the case may be, um, you know, it, it's a good uh, way to kind of follow those guys. So without further ado, here's the Fall League uh, All-Star Game Master. I'll just do it up real slowly here for you all. Actually, uh, Seth Beard and Joe Adele, I got um, Pro Debut's uh, autos, in, both of them in one box. So that's pretty nice. I was happy about that. And then back here. That's it? Okay. Like I said, I'll get the rest of them, and uh, they'll be in the, the, the link in the description from the Futures games that happened back in July. So this is the top loader box. So if you don't know this product, it looks just like the uh, Topps Heritage this year. And except it's minor league players. This is but these top loaders look very different. I don't know what this minor league team is, but I see them all the time with the mustache head. I think it's pretty cool. So Mateus. And he plays for, oh, it's a Lexington Legend. That's what it is. I forgot about that. But pretty cool card. All right. Open his first box. So today was a big release day for, uh, or actually yesterday was a big release day for um, Bowman Draft, which I'm going to pick up, I think, on Hobby Day on the 8th uh, at my local uh, hobby shop. Nolan Gorman, so here's one of his. He's a hot prospect for the Cardinals. So like this. I get excited when I see a guy like this um, that I can set aside and be like, yeah, maybe someday. Some of these guys, I just don't know who they are. If you know who they are, please let me know. Mountcastle. He was supposed to uh, make it to the big leagues this year, and I don't think he did. But his name is familiar from uh, the Bowman Chrome series that came out earlier today, earlier this year. Uh, Amaya, this is a Cubs prospect. 
if you see someone that I don't know or I don't make a big deal about, please let me know so I can uh, go back and check them out. But like I said, this is just a fun pack to rip. Um, no, uh, not looking for anything big. Except for a couple of few names that I do know, and I'll put them out to y'all if I see them. This is going to be my, I don't know who they are. Oh, no, there's the one I really wanted. So, Tebow. Um, he's such a good guy. If you follow his Instagram account, man, he is blessed, a blessed human being. Um, I got his Bowman Chrome this year. I got his his cards from uh, Heritage last year. So that's going to go into PC because I'm just i a big fan of Tebow. Seth Beard is another prospect. He's supposed to have an outstanding career. Um, so i got to do a better job keeping this in front. I really don't like doing breaks. Oh, next one. There we go. Juan Franco, he's the number one prospect of all baseball. Happy to have that one. There we go, that was a good start. Now the one I'm really looking for, being a White Sox fan, is Nick Madrigal and Luis, Luis Robert Robert, however you pronounce it, but I'm a big fan of those guys. Uh, Brandon McKay, so he's a he's a, in the top five I know for prospects this year. Matt Mercer, Cal Raleigh, Bobby Lobeck, he's a Red Sox uh, hot prospect. Supposed to be a um, batting like a Pedroia. Uh, maybe he'll. I don't think he's going to be taking over uh, Devers, but maybe he'll take over second base. Who knows for the Red Sox. Uh, Mackenzie Gore, um, another high prospect. Uh, I believe he is with um, uh, Tampa Bay. Dumbass, uh, you know, Leonardo Jimenez. How about that? So where Brandon McKay, one of these two guys. Uh, let's see. I want to verify. One of these two is a Otani where he pitches. There, there it is. It's Brennan McKay. So he pitches in DHs also. So that's interesting. I don't think Tampa Bay is going to let him do that. Um, he came up for just a little bit, and I think he went back down. But, um, yeah, we'll see if they let him do pulling Otani. I like seeing the, the minor league uniforms too. Something different. Don't know. Don't know. Bang titles, nah. Uh, keep Bryant Hayes. He's a he's a he's a hot prospect. Uh, I think with the Cincinnati Reds. We'll handle. Oh, look at that, Franco All Star. That's pretty sweet. Fans of him. Man, how about Bowman Chrome? People went bananas over his stuff. Gage Canning. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Jordan Alvarez. That's another one I wanted. That's sweet. He doesn't have a lot of cards out there, but uh, I'll take his minor league card. He's going to be, people are going to go crazy off of, uh, maybe not opening day, but series one when it comes out next year. People are going to be going bananas trying to get his auto, whatever you get on his kid. Which I don't think he deserved rookie of the year. I think Eloy did. Um, just my personal opinion. But we'll leave it at that. Tristan Casa? Don't know. Garrett Wilclack? Don't know. Diaz? No. Isaiah Gillian? No. Let's insert. Bean Burroughs, I don't know. Luis Garcia. Why does that sound familiar? Hmm. i got to verify on him. I'll verify him later. I have 
this next pack. Alright. <laughs> Nick Neardist. Alright, Daniel Johnson. Ryan Costello. Oh, I've ever fighting him. That sounds familiar. Stop. Nah. Joey Bart is another hot name. Alex Sheffield. Shefford. Kyle. Whatever. <laughs> I'm horrible with these names. But this is because the Silver Jack fight. <laughs> Bears beat the Cowboys, 31-24. I'm still not uh, drinking the Mitchell Trubisky Kool-Aid. I'll let you know that. All right. Uh, no, no, no. Royce Lewis, he's a really hot prospect. Um, I believe with the Minnesota Twins. I'll have to verify that one, but he is a, he's a prospect. Dylan Cease. White Sox pitcher prospect. He came up at the end of last year and didn't do too well. Hopefully he can turn around and show up our uh, rotation. Uh, Trevor Lawrence, don't know. Corey Ray, don't know. Pierre Lambert, don't know. Alcevedo, don't know. And Cinto Sanchez, don't know. So I don't really dabble in, pros in uh, minor league cards too much. Um, I bought one box at the National of Pro Debut, and that was my my first um, box ever buying a Pro Debut. This is my first box of Heritage ever buying. What I do buy is the Bowman Draft because I just I love the cards. I love Chrome cards, so uh, I do. I don't mind investing in that. Uh, and I only buy one one box. I think last year I bought it was three fifty. We'll see what it is this year. Uh, here's Keybron Hayes. I talked about him earlier. Um, I think it is with Cincinnati, but he's a he's a good prospect. This guy he came up with the Yankees and then went back to home. I think. I think that's it. Um, I don't know about that. Congratulations. What's this? You received a pro debut insert. I uh, will read about that later. The. Nah. Don't know those guys. <laughs> All right, next one. Oh, this one feels a little thicker. And I think I see something in there. The middle. So we'll see. Freeman, Ian Anderson, pitcher for the Braves, came up this year. Ah, Keeson came up uh, this year for the Twins. Good player. I mean, not Twins, I'm sorry, um, Milwaukee Brewers. So we'll see uh, how he does for his sophomore year, playing second base. And this is going to be Jody Reed uh, Materials, um, game used. So that's probably going to be something I donate to the kids or something. Jose Devers. I have any relation to Rafael? I don't think so. Hickson and Michael King. And you know what? I'm just noticing my phone may die, so if we uh, lose contact here, it's uh, my apologies, and it's probably be the worst video I've ever made. But anyway, uh, Javier Christian, uh, Roberto Ramos, Clark Schmidt, Owen Miller. No, I have to go back and look at some of these guys. Pitchers, I just automatically count out because I don't invest in pitchers. Um, Benjamin, you get now. Don't know any of those guys. So I have to go back and check out the rosters from the Fall League All Star game and the Futures Leagues game. All right, 
right. Nope. Nope. Sean Murphy, nope. Oh, there's a car backwards here. Is this our auto? Oh, tell me it's an auto. No, it's numbered. It's Brendan Rogers who came up with the Rockies. Is it? No, just a blue one. Not bad, though. Brendan Rogers came up with the Rockies this year. 54 out of 99. Like that. I'll take that one. Alex. Is Filmington? No, Phil Pinkington. Uh, YouTube guy out there. Toro. Nah. You're going to end up a lot of uh, cards you don't need. But like I said, it's a fun product to rip. Buy one. And it was 50% off, so I was happy with it. But Joe Adele, Angels prospect. He's supposed to be really good. Uh, I got his auto, like I said, from uh, Pro Debut. The sticker auto, but, eh, you know, whatever. It is what it is. Cowards, Tristan, Casada. I think I saw him earlier. Yeah. DJ Hall, Newton, Force Whitley, uh, pitcher for the Astros. Supposedly um, highly uh, rated, but he hasn't come up yet, or he came up and went back down, one or the other. We'll set him to a side. I think he's, he has the same thing with Kyle Tucker. He was up at the same time, and then he went back down. Which I'm, I hear so much buzz about Kyle Tucker. I don't know. He did okay in the World Series, but I don't know, hopefully he has a better year. He gets one of the spots in the outfield. Uh, Brent Honeywell. He's a um, highly graded pitcher. Libertor. Tejada. Kyle Lewis. Kyle Lewis sounds familiar. i got to verify him. Jonathan India, another Cincinnati Red prospect. He's supposed to be really good. William Contreras. That sounds familiar too. I want to verify him. Jones. And then an insert. Jonathan Nini is him, and there's some other prospect. The other prospect, he was the MVP for the All Star game. And I don't know why this, the pro team hasn't brought him up yet, but. Um, Dane Dunning, he's a pitcher for the White Sox. He came up, went back. He's been up and down. Um, yeah, I'll just put him off to the side. Royce Lewis, there he is. Speaking of the devil. So Royce Lewis uh, for the Twins has been up and down. He was an all-star. Man, my focus is horrible on this. I apologize to whoever's watching this video. But Royce Lewis is, um, you know, supposed to be a huge stud. And he was the MVP of the All Star game for uh, the, the future um, future stars. There's another Joe Adele All Star, Sanchez, Brian Abreu, Nate Peterson. Yeah. So no autos yet. We got one um, memorabilia card, which I'm not a big fan of those. I do not collect them. I've got one in my collection. It's a Joe D uniform card from Upper Deck back in like 2001 or something like that. And this, uh, Anthony Key. I apologize, this is a little bit longer video than I normally put up. Joey Bart, uh, another hot prospect. Insert White. Okay, we got two packs left. Maybe, oh no, we got four packs left. Maybe one of them will have an auto. Let's see. I'm not feeling very good about this box so far. Insert. Gomez. Brooker. Teus. I don't know. Mackenzie Gore, All Star. I like the All Star cards. They're nice. I got this. I got the whole set for. Um, this year's um, Tops Heritage Pro MLB. And I have a, or used to have, I should say, Willie Mays from 1970 of that All-Star card. And I uh, sold it a long time ago. All right. 
Uh, done. Please. Baker. Here's another one. Oh, congratulations. Cards. Keegan Thompson. Sanchez. Isabel. DJ Peters. All right. Last pack. I'll put you on your misery. I appreciate you viewing. Uh, if you see this, like, subscribe, tell your friends. I appreciate it. I'm trying to get my views up. Uh, downs, insert, Halsley. Oh, there's our auto. Oh, Tristan Kassan. Yeah, I think he's a decent player. I got to verify him, but there's our auto. Tristan Kassan. I'll look him up later. Kenya, Dustin May. So I got his Bowman Chrome Auto um, uh, last year when it came out. And that went with a PSA sub back in July, and I still have not got it yet. So that's interesting. Taylor Trammell is another stud. It's supposed to be coming up, I think, with Cincinnati also. Cincinnati's got some prospects out there. But uh, here's another stud that's supposed to be coming out, so... All right, that's it. 2019 Minor League Heritage. I appreciate you all watching. Like, subscribe, and uh, collect what you want, not what you need. Thank you all for watching.